Part of efforts to address the rising cost of living in Nigeria, residents of Jobori, a community in Giri local government area of Adamawa State, can now buy cereal at half the market price. The Philanthropic Act is aimed at cushioning the effects of subsidy removal, which has given birth to a continuous rise in inflation in Nigeria. Silas Lowen reports. Winners to feed their families started getting woes in May this year, shortly after President Tinubu, in his inaugural address, declared that fuel subsidy was gone. A businessman, Shaibu Idris, who says he is feeling the hardship of the Lesperi village, decided to sell his food stuff at a subsidized rate, believing it will go a long way toward reducing the difficulties faced by households. <laughs> We are rolling out these palliative measures to take Allah's favor only. We are buying this cassava at the rate of 700 and sell at 350 naira. Pasta at the rate of 450 and sell it for 250 naira. We are also buying rice at the market price of 1,500 and give it out at 900 per measures. Beneficiaries say the initiative has since its first day started putting smiles on their faces. They call on governments and other well-to-do individuals to emulate the gesture. Yes, sir, I wonder I can take one gash and so cut the parashi my and Zaka Babu put in the Zesia. There are many that can't afford the full stop at this chief price. They are empty handed. Our well-to-do and government personalities should help the poor. The way this man is supporting us. Yesterday, I bought mess and took it from Merlin. It was stolen, this money. Government should not let the masses down. However, an eyewitness, Haruna Audu, alleged that while selling of the subsidized food staff was ongoing, some individuals were buying the cheap food staff to sell them at a higher price, not far from the venue. If you take this food to your house and feed your kids or your neighbor, eat it, or to your neighbor, God will reward you when you are helping people, but some are diverting what you are giving. You will feel discouraged. With this development, the neighborhood is not just joyous, but hopeful that the action will inspire more businesses to follow suits. Silas Lawan, Trust TV News, Yola.